Berlin by Night by M. Riff Chapter 04 Brunch After a while, she emerged wearing Marita's bathrobe and with a towel around her hair. Azer hadn't shaved yet, but he had taken the initiative to set up brunch using food from the ethnic stores nearby. Topaz poured herself some fresh orange juice and asked, When is your appointment with the neurology professor? Azer answered, I've got an appointment at 5 p.m. sharp. In Germany, being on time is crucial. The professor has squeezed Eric in as an additional patient. He continued, I doubt it'll take too long. I've sent the professor Eric's hospital papers in advance. He'll likely ask a few follow-up questions about the condition. Taking a sip of his coffee, Azer suggested, in the meantime, we could explore the city by bike if you're up for it. Topaz declined, saying, I'm done with biking. I'd rather take public transport somewhere and take a walk. If we stumble upon a good restaurant for the evening or discover a great spot for photos, that'd be perfect. After showering and eating, Topaz seemed more relaxed. She pointed to her cell phone on the table, saying, Did you know that the computer they used to send humans to the moon had less computing power than this phone? Isn't it incredible? Azer agreed, absolutely. Back then, a computer with less power than a phone needed a whole truck to move around. Now everyone's got that kind of power in their pocket. Curious, Topaz asked, have you ever heard about Van Gogh's ear? Azer could understand the question, but he still asked with a smile, you mean the one he cut off? Topaz responded, I think he only cut off part of his ear. But that's not what I had in mind. I'm talking about the security chip planted in the corner of the paintings, known as Van Gogh's ear. She added, there are four or five museums in Berlin with classical paintings. We could visit one of them. Azer smiled saying, I didn't know you were into art. I thought you were planning to go on a shopping spree all over the city. Topaz, swiping through images on her phone, remarked, Tomorrow, until we leave, I'm going to dedicate my time to shopping. Azer asked, Would it be alright if you go shopping without me? Topaz replied, Why? Would you prefer wandering with your big camera, capturing street scenes? Before Azer could reply to her sarcastic remark, she added, By the way, there's a Picasso exhibition somewhere close. Examining the map on her cell phone, she noticed, it's not far from here.